Many times people ask me, didn't the Bible predict the ingathering of the Jews in their land and that this state is, is the fulfillment of prophecy and that this is what the Bible talked about? Uh, to answer simply, I ask, let us read the prophets. Let us read what the Bible spoke about. And when we read that, we will see that the prophet spoke about a much more holistic restoration, the renewal of all of creation, the renewal of the human nature, the circumcision of hearts, the forgiveness of sins, and then the presence of the messianic figure, the Messiah who will uh, execute justice and rule in peace and bring uh, harmony and reconciliation between all peoples. The prophet spoke about a universal kingdom in which nations will come to the house of the Lord. They will throw away their weapons and worship the God of Jacob. This is much more glorious than what we see today in Palestine. I mean, we should ask, is what we see today with the creation of the state of Israel really the fulfillment of those prophecies? Those prophecies are one package. You cannot simply take one element, the presence of Jews in their land, and conclude this is fulfillment of prophecies. If you take the Bible seriously, you must ask, what about the rest of these elements in, the, in, in these prophecies? But more importantly, we must ask, how does the New Testament read these prophecies? Did Jesus and Paul refer to these prophecies? And of course, again, the answer is yes. They saw in what Jesus did in his life and in his teaching as the fulfillment of these uh, prophecies. They saw in his kingdom that he inaugurated on earth, a kingdom that includes people from every tribe, nation, a manifestation of the new heavens and the new earth that the prophets spoke about. Uh, in other words, we must simply, we cannot simply read these prophets as if Christ did not return. Paul says all the promises of God find their yes in Jesus. Jesus said, read the scripture because it talks about me, it points to me. And as Christians, we cannot ignore the centrality of Christ in any reading we do of scripture.